Hey guys, it's your girl Maya. So I know that I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this video, but as my shirt says, I really don't care. But now I'm gonna take it off because I'm kinda hot. Um, but yeah. First I wanna start off by like, um, going back to the video that I posted about Eugenia Cooney and some responses I got from it and just like what I wanted to say about it and then what I want to say now. Um, okay, so a lot of people, um, well not a lot of people, but a few people did say it was really weird of me to tell Eugenia to reach out to me and stuff like that and um, well, she actually did watch and comment on one of my vlogs that I made. I made a vlog um, shortly after her, um, you know, premiere back on YouTube, I guess you could call it. Um, like, you know, uh, defending her and being like, you know, give her time. Recovery takes time and stuff like that. But that was over a year ago and she's gotten worse. Um, so that's one reason why I did talk to her in the video. Also, I found out that she does watch every video that people make about her, so, you know. Um, but yeah, I'm trying not to, like, be hateful here. Like, I'm still trying to give her the benefit of the doubt by saying that she's probably being controlled by somebody, um, and being forced to, you know, live the lifestyle that she's living. Um, but yeah. That is what I wanted to, like, talk about about the first video, and the first video, well, not the first video, but the video that I most recently did about her. Um, it was a pretty uneducated video. I didn't really know what was going on. I just saw her Sailor Moon cosplay video, and it really, really, like, bugged me. And I don't use this word, um, well, I do use this word lightly, but when I really use it, I really mean it, so it's like, you know, it's like I'll throw it around sometimes, but when I'm really using it, I'm really using it. And I will tell you right now that I, when I watched some of the videos, I watched this guy Sloan, and um, I don't know much about him, um, but he seems pretty honest, and, you know, um, he's pretty fed up with the bullshit as well, um, because he's also gone through um, eating disorder problems, which I have gone through, which is why this bothers me so much, but... Um, I never really watched Eugenia, Eugenia Cooney um, before, um, and I'm not really super interested in her live streams or her videos. I was just, I am just a concerned person because I see her going down like a really horrible path, and um, yeah, it just doesn't seem like it's going to get any better, um, but yeah, she's, I don't like saying this, and I, um, always said that it was a horrible thing to say about someone, but she is, as my title says, she is a trigger, um, and it definitely, she is triggering me to the point where, and before you even say you don't have to watch her, I'm not, I will not be watching her anymore. Um, I love Sloan very much, he's hilarious, and his videos are great, I will not be watching his Eugenia Cooney videos because... I can't handle it. I can't do it. And, um, for a while I was also, like, um, against that petition to get her off social media, but now I'm like, maybe she really does need to get off of social media because she's, like, making people think that this is okay. That, um, and she can be in denial all she wants, but nobody is supposed to look like that, um, and be healthy. Um, I don't know what's going on in her brain that she, my cat is crazy, okay, but I don't know what's going on in her brain that she doesn't seem to recognize it, I mean, I did learn a few things about her from Sloan that she was homeschooled and, um, pretty much she makes the money for the family, so that's why I try not to send hate towards her, and I don't want you guys to send hate towards her either, um, it's just that I am seeing that there's a possibility that someone is controlling her and I'm not gonna say who because people said that it was really fucked up of me to say who it was but we all know who it is um, that is quite possibly controlling her and um, yeah I just really do think um, you know maybe a lot of people don't understand um, 
wanting her off the internet because maybe you don't have kids or anything like that. I don't have kids, but I have young people in my life. I have nieces and nephews, and I would be absolutely horrified if they watched Eugenia Yacuni and got, like, inspired because the way that she she shows herself off, she's constantly body checking, um, you know, lying about her hair, like, that is not, her hair is not real. Someone commented on my video about Eugenia Cooney, well, she's got really nice hair, and I didn't say anything, but I really wanted to be like, you really think that's her hair? Like, you really think that's her hair? Really? You really think that? She's not getting protein in her body. Hair is protein, or at least that's what I heard from Sister Sister, I don't know if that's 100% true or not, um, but, yeah. She's not getting the nutrients that it takes to grow that kind of hair. That is not her real hair. I don't care what anyone says. Um, but yes, she is constantly body checking herself. And that's, I just, I cannot watch her because what she is actually making the video about doesn't even matter because you're just watching. <laughs> Right, right now you're watching a person getting annoyed by her cat, but you're essentially, I don't, oh God, I don't want to say it because it sounds awful, but you're essentially watching someone slowly deteriorate. That's the way I'm going to say it because I don't want to say what I said in the last video, but that is the ultimate. That's what's going to happen. You know, you're going to wither away into nothing and once there's nothing there's nothing um there's no more twitch there's no more youtube there's no more um final fantasy you're gone and uh a lot of people are going to be heartbroken a lot of people are going to feel betrayed um a lot of fans already feel betrayed um i feel betrayed um because i did make that video you know um very uneducated video um that was you know last year uh when when Shane Dawson made the video and um or I don't know when he made the video but whenever she made her official comeback on YouTube I was like you know give her time you know her arms aren't gonna just magically get bigger um but now that I'm seeing her, I'm seeing that she's just continuously getting worse. And really, I don't mean any hate with any of this at all. A lot of y'all, like, probably will say that I'm, like, hating on her and shit like that. But I'm not hating on her. I'm concerned for her. Um, I feel a little anger towards her because, you know, you do have to be a self-advocate. But I don't know what's happened in her life. There could have been something very tragic happened in her life where she cannot, she actually really can't take control of her own, um, life. And if that's the case, then I feel horrible for her. And really, no hate towards Eugenia Cooney. No hate towards her at all. It's just, it's a lot of confusion. Um, I'm seeing a lot of denial happening. Um, I know that... A lot of fans are betrayed, a lot of people um, in the mental health community that, you know, really, really believe that she was going to make a change this time, you know, and it's, she's going backwards again, and it's, we're going to see another video like the uh, Final Fantasy one that she did, um, and then she's going to be off the internet, and one of these days we're going to get that news, and you know what news I'm talking about. And a lot of y'all are sick as fuck, and I know that you're waiting for it, and you cannot wait for it, and you're like, you want it to happen, and fuck you for that. Um, I don't want it to happen. That's why I'm making these videos, because I'm trying to reach out to her. I know that it's pretty much pointless, but I'm trying, because I don't want to see that happen. I don't want that. I don't want people who seriously hate her to get what they want. Um, yeah. Yeah. But as for watching anything to do with her, <clears throat> I will not be doing, and uh, yeah, I will most likely not be doing any more uh, videos about her um, since I won't be watching her anymore, so there won't be anything to talk about. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys can be cool about it, and I lost some subscribers, but that's okay. 
Um, according to one of my old subscribers, apparently I pay for my subscribers. If I paid for my subscribers, don't you think I'd be up to 10k by now? I only have 2k subscribers. You really think I'd fuck? No. No. Okay, <laughs> so. But yeah, that's just like the hate I've been getting uh, for that video. And like I said, um, there was no hate men in it. And there's no hate men in this video. I know that it... Sometimes you have to be harsh with people like Eugene Yakumi. I'm sorry. You just have to because she is not addressing the situation and that's not asking a lot I don't think but it could be because one second but yeah again um just no hate towards her no like serious hate I don't hate her um I don't want anything bad to happen to her I want the best for her because I've been in her situation um I have not quite been as bad and my uh, ED is quite different than other people's ED. It's a very rare form of ED that is caused by me having the fear of throwing up and um, but yeah uh, what I was saying I really hope you guys can see past my inability to um, speak properly what I want to say and uh, see the good intentions behind it because I'm not a bad person like I am a youtuber yes I know but I'm a small time youtuber and I'm just like my goal for my youtube is to be as honest and as like real just so that you know because there's so many people out there that are living fake lives um on youtube and uh not showing their real selves and yeah I guess that's all I want to say and I hope that you guys um you know understand and see that this is not hate this is concern yes it is going to be a clickbaity video there is a reason for that okay hate me all you want unsubscribe i don't care um not really hurting for subscribers because of what i actually do on youtube which is reactions and also i sing and stuff like that but yeah um yeah, so if you have a problem with anything that I've said, you can feel free to comment. I most likely will not be commenting back because at this point I'm just kind of fed up and um, I did want to get this stuff off my chest though about um, all the things I've learned um, and just realizations that I have made myself. Um, yeah, I just, again, no hate towards Eugenia and do not go to Eugenia and give her hate. Um, but also, um, yeah, I think I will, um, link the petition to get her off of, uh, social media. Um, it's wrong. Um, she's getting paid to starve herself on Twitch. And, yeah, it's just, it's sad. Um, I think that she needs to be away from social media for her own benefit. Um. She wasn't ready to come back when she came back. Um, and I also feel a little bit of, you know, I mean, I don't hate her, but I feel a bit of anger that she did use Shane's platform. And I'm always forever going to be a Shane lover. I'm never going to see any wrong in him. I do, however, think that Ryland is using the fuck out of him and he needs to get away from, it, from that relationship. But anyway, I just, uh, you know, Shane went out of his way to do that for her. And she, t she totally squandered it. She, he gave her so, so much opportunity to change and, you know, make her YouTube not about her eating disorder, but make it about who she is as a person. She has things that she likes to do. She loves video games and Final Fantasy and cosplay. And, but when people watch her videos, or at least in my situation, maybe this makes me a fucked up person and I don't know, but... I can't see the cosplay. I can't see her talking about the video game that she likes because all I can notice is that she's not getting better. And it's not because I'm like obsessed with like her downfall or anything like that. It's because I'm truly concerned for her as a person who has suffered from anorexia. Um, yeah. So I'm going to stop that there and... Hopefully you guys will understand uh, that I do mean this in a very, the best way that I can. Um, 
I have to be a little harsh, so please understand that. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say that will, there's, there's gonna be people that are going to hate me for this video. There's gonna be down votes. There's gonna be all of that and that's okay. It's okay. Um, so yeah, I just really wanted to, um, I've been thinking about it for days. I've been ruminating on making this video. So. All right guys, so I hope you guys still like me. <laughs> um, yeah, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Daisy, Matane.